Yes. Um, how are you, good people? Welcome once again to Rajas Kakasungura YouTube channel. Um, I am overwhelmed. I don't even know what to say because the rate at which our subscribers is moving is really encouraging because we have clocked 443 which is a good milestone and i really thank each and everyone who takes his time or her time to share our content and for those who have subscribed i want to thank you so so much for your kind support continue subscribing and uh, as i always say please before you subscribe go through my channel go through my content let it be a reason why you subscribe to my channel it's not just because of subscribing but then get a reason why you are subscribing because i'm here also to impact your life in a positive way i will also be glad to hear your views on the comment section please if if you have um a comment let me hear let me hear what these episodes have done to your life and if there is anything that we should talk about kindly let me know uh, on the comment section and if there is anything that we need to improve kindly i request you please uh, comment and I will really uh, urgently and uh, uh, respond as fast as possible. There is an elephant in the room that is um, dragging us behind. Either me or you watching this video. You know, you ask people, why have you not started business? Somebody tells you, I fear it will collapse. You ask somebody, why have you not married? He tells you, I fear uh, my wife might run away because maybe I don't have money or what. You ask somebody why you're not married, it tells you, I, I fear. You know, we fear for the unknown. Some people are stagnant or you as a person, you are stagnant where you are because of fear to move. So many people, they fear to move. You are earning a very small salary because you fear to quit that job. You fear to look for another job. You know, you are suffering in marriage because you fear to make a step. You are, uh, you are poor, for instance. Or you cannot sustain yourself financially because you fear to make a step. Fear is a great enemy to success. I have seen so many people starting YouTube channels and they ask me, Kakasungura, how, how do you succeed in this? And I tell them, you know, such things need one, you persevere. Two, you be consistent. And number three, listen less from people. The people who see you coming up and then all they want is a character of human beings always, they'll push you down. So if you're not very careful, you will just go down, down, down and bury yourself completely. In this world, you need perseverance, you need consistent, and then listen less from friends or from people. The Bible is very clear, and as I always say, Kaka, my argument, the Bible is the supreme in my arguments. Now, I will refer a couple of verses on what the Bible says about fear. You know, today, you haven't moved from where you are you haven't moved from your single room because you fear to pay rent in a double house, you know. But then, I'll come to give you my testimony uh, in, a, in another episode on how I beat fear to start my own company, which runs Kissy Hot TV, almost I live um, recording studio, and almost I live limited. I'll come to give you that testimony on how I beat fear. You know, I was once a journalist in one of the leading media houses in Kenya, a reporter, radio reporter, one of the national uh, radio stations. But I moved out. Why? Because I wanted something better in my life than what I was doing. When I realized this thing is not taking me the way I want, I just shook off the fear and I made it a quit. I didn't fear how I will earn, I didn't fear how I will live, but then I made it, you know. So fear is the greatest enemy to success. The Bible tells me in the book of James chapter 1 verse number 2 to 4. The Bible tells me in the book of James chapter number 1 
you start from verse 2 to 4. My brothers and sisters, whenever you face trials of many kinds, because you know that the testing of your faith produces perseverance, and let perseverance finish its work so that you may be mature and complete. What do I mean? The Bible is explaining that after you persevere in problems, after you risk and persevere, be consistent. There are two rewards, as the Bible says in this verse. Mature and complete. You become mature and you become complete. But upon working hard, persevering, beating fear, so you become mature and you become complete. It's not me. It's the Bible verse. Let me read you another verse here. Um, let me read for you another verse here. There's a verse I was reading here about fear. Let me, my Bible is taking time to open, but then, um, let me, let me, let me, let me open. Yes. Uh, huh. <clears throat> it's here. It's here. It's here. It's here. It's here. The Bible says in the book of uh, 2 Timothy chapter 1 verse 7, For the Spirit of God um gave us does not make us timid but gives us power love and self-discipline so have self-discipline persevere work hard and you will make it you want to start a business start it shake off the fear fail and start again you know not fear marry bona don't fear utapatia nini mukeba she will come with blessings i think i thought you in a, in, a, in a previous episode that women come with blessings in marriage so do not fear. Just wake up from where you are and make a step today. A journey of a thousand miles begins with a single footstep. So today, if I'm speaking to a young person listening or watching to me this time, I want to tell you one thing you should do in life is making a trial. Do not fear to fail. Do not fear to start. Start. Fail. Shake off the dust. Start again. And I think in one or two to three days, you will become successful and have a testimony to tell people. It's Rogers Kakasungura YouTube channel. Kindly click subscribe. See you in the next episode.